I know. We had to get in disguise for this video, man. You know. <laughs> had to clean up right. You know what I mean? <laughs> now they call me Agent 57. And, uh, <laughs> y'all know what I do. So, uh, they told me to tell y'all this intro, so. What's up, y'all? Y'all know who it is, man. Agent 57 here, AKA Agent Lethal. And, uh, we back up in this thing with another video though man we on the ps5 hitman 3 bro they had to call in a specialist for this one and uh, i hope y'all enjoy it you feel me <laughs> what else what, what else i need to say oh we we, we can just go ahead so i can continue my contract yeah <laughs> don't get killed you know i would do it Let's get to the video. Agent 47 oh, and he Diana made Agent Burnwood 57. are the world's top assassins working for the oh, ICA. Get stuff together. Unknowingly, to they have been hired right. by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence, a secret organization working in the highest echelons of power. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal. Eliminate the shadow client and learn about 47's past. But when 47 discovers that the shadow client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend, he and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact. Destroy Providence. Okay. Together, they manage to capture the Constant, forcing him to reveal the identities of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. Oh, see, see, see. However, the constant has an ace up his sleeve. Got an ace up his sleeve. Hmm. Look closer. In the shadows. Behind the everyday world. Beyond the headlines and the seats of power. A hidden hand. kind of company known as Providence. So he got a homie to that he it, actually going we on a date just with? assets to use and throw away to do the unthinkable, the unforgivable. And it never gave us a second thought until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back. Me and 47. Oh, man. Much has been lost. This but game we are closer be fire. than ever. I can already tell, bro. We trapped the constant, Providence's chief controller, and finally learned the names of its three partners. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. And just maybe look towards the future. 37. It's time. Hey, we about to parachute down? Like, what the heck? The dope not start in the game, skydiving you into know, the goddamn map. I never planned this far ahead. You never do. I see someone got his memory back. Wait, is that a beacon? Oh, that was out of here. What the hell? Base. 
Lexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations, over. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and oh resources. My God. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar Al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking money. and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. Carl Ingram is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew Boy, rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War on. and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal, and steel. Both families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming, so Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Stuyvesant and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Oh my god. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. Happy hunting. Oh, okay. That was a hell of an intro, though, too. If you made it that far, bro, drop a like, subscribe to your boy, man. Just drop a like for this jacket. Come on. Welcome to this. Dubai, 47. Look at this. Can't tell me I ain't clean. Today is the inauguration of the Scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Oh Good my luck, God, look where I'm starting at. 47, oh. come in. 47, do you copy? I'm here. Are you I'm in here. position? I'm heading 57, do you copy? I'm, uh, I'm here, bro. Get back to me when you're there. I don't know why they keep calling me 47. Hmm. I mean, do I climb this? I'm kind of scared. Nah, I don't. in that toolbox. Oh, the tools. Oh, this look crazy on PlayStation. Oh, that music. Hopefully that ain't a copyright music because that'd be fucked up. Mm, you kind of need that. 47, use your camera and scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the Windows controls from here. Oh, my God. I had to keep my, equip the camera. All right. Let me see. Let me see. All right, boy. Navigate. Oh, you can put filters on it? All right. So, it's telling me to use my camera. All right. Bro, I had the camera on there the whole time. Position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close inauguration, by. Inauguration, and that's Once happening you've literally today. Get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. Oh, Jesus, we can't let that happen. so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. He mean 57. Sorry, guys. They, must, they messed up something in the game. I need to put a disguise on. I can't put nothing on yet. He clean up just like I do. All right. This is. On behalf of His Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali, I bid you welcome to the center. Thank you, brother. 
This mother look clean on PlayStation. Jesus. Welcome. Just take this all in, y'all. Just take this all in. Look at this. But with a small loan from my mother. I mean, you can Small loans from my family. You sound like Donald Trump up there right now. All right, I'm trying to get all my bearings back. You know what I'm saying? Okay, that's how I check. Get my camera out. I would like to thank my cousins without whose friendship. This one is crazy. I'm proud to yet again immortalize our great family. I'll go check this out, you know what I'm saying? Listen, I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. We'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. All right, all right. It looks like the staff area could provide you with a viable route to the server room. Staff area. Nice take the staff you. area. Hmm? I wonder if I can run right now. Ugh, I can feel the adaptive triggers right now too. I don't even remember. Look at us just cruising, bro. Just cruising over, you know, just casually walking through this mug, man. Going to the staff area. Trying to do this mug all the way in depth on this first mission, bro. There's a keypad lock on the doors to the staff area. One moment. All right, try this. Four seven zero six. Oh my God. Four seven zero six. All right, there go. Okay. There's quite a bit of security here. One moment. You ready for some more fresh air, 47? Oh, Jesus. Let me get on my creep, you know what I'm saying? James Corden's sick today, of all days. His Highness has everyone working triple shifts. There's so much going on. Uh, oh, shoot. I did not Stop see this person. You bastard. Shut up. Shut up! Why the heck they find his body? Oh Jesus, come on. Come on, get off this wall. Oh my god. Shut up! Shut up, shut up. Tired of playing with y'all. Just some dope, some dope. Come on, shoot him! Mm -mm. Shut up! All right. All right. I want to disguise myself as one of them. Then, you know, I'm going to drag his body. Come here. I don't know where to put y'all. Oh, he got a locker. Thank God. So, uh, this is going bad already. See how many people I can put in here. Long as don't nobody else come, we'll be straight. How many people can I put in this one? Oh yeah, just line them up in there. <laughs> see if I can throw her up in there. So you should use it the wrong place at the wrong time, baby girl. See if I can throw her little butt up in there. Oh, it's full. No. Hide her right on over here. Right on over here. You know what I'm saying? Hey, now I gotta figure out something to do with you. 
I gotta pick this gun up though. All right, how I put the gun up? All right, there we go. Put the gun up. You know what I'm saying? Now you, hopefully ain't nobody down here so I can hide you too. Let me look around. I ain't doing nothing, just hiding somebody in the toilet. You know, just gonna hide them on up in the, you know, in here, you know what I'm saying? Shouldn't hurt nobody being hid up in here, right? All right, I got my camera out. I think I can open that window remotely. Scan the lock with your camera and I'll have a try. Yeah, just get out of here. You too, hurry up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's do this. Cheek Al Ghazali is reaching out to his worldwide network of lawyers and financial contacts, attempting to restore right, the lost bro, power base of the Providence Partners. If Ingram and Stuyvesant were asked to a meeting, thinking they'll be told of new developments, I suspect they'd jump at the chance. There's a lounge area at the top of the building. It can be sealed off for private conversations. If we lure the targets there, they'll be trapped. Bro, how do I get up there? Every time we lure the targets there, goddamn. Ah, okay, I see it. Let's go. We on our real deal, like Agent Fifty Seven stuff right now, man. Let's go. Now this dude is a real assassin right here, bro. God dang, I wouldn't have never been able to hang off the side of the building like this, bro. should be behind one of the doors in this hallway. I don't got a lock pick. All right, that's the toilet. There's no way it's behind there. Damn. Hey, you, you're trespassing. Fuck. Shut up. Trespassing when I get your disguise on. Uh. Now, give me your outfit. Now, Jesus, I gotta drag him somewhere. Take you to the toilet, boy. Or the storage room. Oh my God. Oh my God, it's a camera right here. I'm sorry, bro. This gotta happen. Yep, I, got, I gotta put you to sleep. I gotta put you to sleep. I'm sorry. Like, y'all, I gotta put you in this locker. <laughs> bro, I'm sorry, bro. I'm over here creeping, bro. I'm creeping right now. Get in there, too. God dang. This game getting crazy, bro. Already. <sighs> All right, boy. Next step. Next step. It's the server room. So, uh, server room discovered. Hmm, a calendar function. We can use this to summon the partners to a fake meeting, 47. All right, I'm no hacker like Olivia, but I think you need to pull one of the racks here to gain access to the terminal. Damn it, 
A silent alarm has been tripped. Security is on its way. Hide, 47. Oh my god. Hide? Hide in here? Oh my god. Somewhere to hide in here. The doors are locked. I don't have none of this to fucking hide. Sorry about that, 47. Let's try again, shall we? Ah, I think I've got it. We'll need a key card to gain access. Someone in maintenance should have one we can borrow for a spell. Bro, this dude almost got me killed. It's me. I thought about what you said. Yeah, I changed my mind. It was an insane idea to start with. Exploding golf. Alright, I'm sorry, bro. I know I have issues. Admit it. That's the best step, right? Anyway, I've got to go all up. I mean, I got it right. I mean, how do I get it? All right, there it is. Oh my God, bro. I didn't disguised up like seven times since I've been in this mud. Still is. Well, that must have done something. Can you see anything different in the room? to do is access the terminal and use the calendar option to summon the Providence partners to a meeting. Good work. The meeting has been booked. The partners should be moving up here shortly. Huh. Looks like the lounge can be sealed off for private conversations. Andy? Excellent. I see the partners moving. You should join their meeting. Time to end this, 47. Oh my god. All right, question is, how do I get upstairs now? Hello? Yeah, I just want to remind you about the uh, lockdown drill tomorrow. That's right, 900 hours. Upstairs. I wonder if I go through maintenance.
I gotta walk past these dudes. Ho 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 ho! Find the lounge. They shouldn't be able to tell. issued one tomorrow morning. You know how it works? Because hey, what are you I doing? Don't. Put that thing away. You're going to scare people. Guys, leave us. We need to oh, talk about okay. it. All right, boy. I'm keeping it out. Shut up. Now we'll just wait for the partners to be alone. Then you can activate the room's lockdown feature. The partners are alone now. I'll activate the panel controlling the room's security features. When you're ready, use it to start the show. Do you know what he wants to talk about? No, but I've known this man for a long time. This is so You wouldn't call us up here without good reason. Well, y'all dead. What's this? Carl? Did you do that? I certainly <laughs> did not. I have no idea what's going on. This is fire. Gentlemen, what's the meaning of this? You, you are the one responsible for all this. Gray, what do you want? Something that has been a long time due. Revenge. <laughs> Revenge? How but now? You killed Cobb, Nana Cobb, Caruso, the Washington twins, everyone at Haven. You broke into our bank. And you outed Providence to the world. Whatever Bro. perceived slight we've done to you is insignificant to the amount of damage you've caused us. You've caused the world. You're a murderous terrorist. Nothing more. What did we ever do to you anyway? You specifically? Nothing. Providence? Everything. Providence made me. And at the flick of a pen, Providence broke me. I'm just returning the favor. Up. Oh no, baby! Providence has ruined the lives of countless people, expecting and facing no consequence for its actions. You take for yourselves and those who support you, and you burn everyone and everything else to the ground from the comfort of the shadows. No more. You're delusional. Exposing us achieved nothing beyond moving a few pieces around on a board much more complicated than you can fathom. The world believes we're dead. What more do you want? Me? Nothing. My friend, however, well, let's just say he's a bit of an expert. I'm just here to watch you die. 47, finish it. 47, finish it. Finally, Stuyvesant and Ingram are gone. Providence will soon be no more than a bad memory. Hey. 47. Thank you. I'll meet you at the rendezvous on the edge of town. This card. Now I gotta pull my uh, camera bag out. Camera out. Y'all trying to get me killed out here. We just gonna casually walk out of here like we just smoked them dudes, too. They even change. Hey, it's you. They, they can't really know if you're not on the clock or not. Like some of that stuff be capped. I'm just hopping the helicopter and dude. Oh, well, I got us to do you. 
to the exit, y'all. But she over here knocked. <laughs> Y'all better can. All right, forget it. We did it, bro. Hopefully, man, y'all enjoyed that first mission into Agent 57. You know what I'm saying? But I hope y'all enjoyed it. If y'all did, man, drop a like. Subscribe to your boy, man. Follow me on all of my socials, Twitter, Instagram, man. And hit that post notification bell, bro. So y'all know every time I upload a video. And uh, we gone. Yeah.